Today is the day. House tour. House you guys know exactly what we're doing. We're just gonna like jump right into it. The LeBrand family are about as close to YouTube royalty as it gets. Not to mention they get to film a ton of their content from their beautiful California ranch. But even prior to their family channel taking off, Savannah Sudas made her claim to fame through the now defunct social media app Musical.ly, where she had millions of followers. Hey mom, can I get a Hoya? What? I said, can I get a Hoya? Meanwhile, her husband Cole LeBrant was originally a Vine star with millions of followers in his own right. Holy f- Farty monkey! Son of a b- Bubble burp! Get out of the way! Bring time breath! Yeah. And it doesn't end there with the celebrity in this family. Savannah's daughter from a previous relationship, the pine size Everly, is a star too. In fact, last year she was listed as number three on a list of the richest YouTube kids in the world. Ah! Oh. oh my goodness. How many LOL dolls did you get? Since joining forces and becoming the world famous LeBrant family, Cole and Savannah have had another daughter named Posey and recently a newborn son named Zealand. And as soon as those two are old enough to speak, they'll no doubt be as famous as their older sister, who has her own YouTube channel called Everly Opens Toys, which boasts a 3.38 million subscriber count. Needless to say, the LeBrant family has the YouTube platform locked down with their wholesome, Christian family-inspired lifestyle. They've monetized it into a lucrative revenue stream as social media influencers that often film their vids from the comfort of their own beautiful home. Couple goals. Okay, now. Oh. Thank goodness we have a heated pool. Yep. It's pretty warm. According to Nailbuzz, audiences love to check in on their home life and their channel consists of nearly 13 million subscribers with as many as 6,000 subs being added daily and over 4 billion views accumulated so far. This has generated the family an estimated revenue of around $15,000 a day or $5.5 million a year from the ads that run in their videos. They even work directly with big companies like Ashley Furniture who are willing to supply them with full furnishings for the brand new house they bought in 2019. And all the furniture, Ashley Home Store, the bed, Ashley Home Store, it's gorgeous! Hey guys, it's Kara with a brand new video and today I thought we'd look at the LeBrant family homes here for you on Famous Entertainment. The first home we'll take a look at is their main base of operations they bought last year and the second was a gift that Cole and Savannah bought for Savannah's mother earlier this year. Considering so much of their material is filmed in or around these spots, I thought LeBrant family fans might enjoy this in-depth look at both homes and hopefully watching it will bring you a bit closer to this lovable family. We've also done house tours on the likes of the Hype House and the infamous Graffiti Mansion and we'll link to some at the end. Don't forget to like, hit subscribe and follow me on Instagram to chat. Alright, let's get started. When Cole and Savannah moved into their new home, they struck a deal with Ashley Furniture, who sent an interior designer to work closely with the family and bring their style to life. Speaking with the Ashley website about the decor of the home, the designer stated, I would consider the style a mix between contemporary and vintage. There's this relaxed tone throughout the house with the lighter color schemes too. Overall, it's a gorgeous space that I'm sure a lot of people could relate to. I'm about to show you guys how true that is. Let's start off by taking a look at the interior of the home. Uh, we're gonna go this way. Oh man, this room is, this is like a dining room set that looks so good. Like it literally looks like it's straight, it's straight out of like some beautiful fancy movie. One of the LeBrand's biggest goals was to have a home with ample space for entertaining and dining. With that in mind, the sitting room and dining spaces were furnished with vintage touches and a hint of elegance. Welcome to my second favorite room of the house, the family room! Another goal was to have a space where the family can relax together. So for their living room, they made sure to include a giant sofa where they can unwind and also included a play area for baby Posey nearby to make sure the entire family can spend all their time with one another. The kitchen is one of the couple's favorite places. Cole has said that they spend as much as 90% of their time in this room. That's because all we do is eat. <laughs> I'm relatable. Surprisingly, their favorite feature is a small detail, the bar stools around the kitchen island. Upstairs is the master bedroom, which features relaxed tones and a less is more overall aesthetic. Oh. I love this room. This room is so pretty. This is, this is nice. 
So this is the bed. We sleep on this, you know? Yep. The high ceilings that are featured in the room add an unexpected but welcome touch of elegance, while the two-person shower in the adjoining ensuite bathroom offers multiple levels of practicality. And just in case you're wondering, closet space is not something the LeBrant family is going to have to worry about again. Like, ever. I wanted to get like cool barn doors or something that would slide open. Because I took out the doors that were here already. So it's not going to be open like this, but... For now. This is my closet. And she's got a lot of clothes and a lot of stuff. Meanwhile, Everly's room is probably exactly like you imagined it would be. Everly's bedroom! She is right next Woo, right next door because Everly gets scared at night. A young girl's dream bedroom with more stuffed animals than floor space. The family even dedicated an entire room to watching movies. The these chairs are actually home store as well. But look how awesome these are, you guys. They're like actual like movie theater chairs, like recline and junk. Recline. My favorite part is the lights on the wall. This makeshift style theater arrangement is the perfect space for watching movies together, and it's stocked with delicious candies and drinks to provide that movie theater feel without ever having to leave the comfort of your own home. Of course, no home would be complete without a play space for the kids. Everly and Posey have a space all their own that features a play table to host tea parties and create masterpieces on. The room features a unique color palette of bright shades meant to complement the fun-loving disposition of those who use it. One thing's for sure, step foot in this room and you're bound to feel like a kid again. Outside the home is beautiful weather on a regular basis provided by the city of Los Angeles, so the LeBrands get to enjoy sunshine all year long. The family decorated their outdoor space with light wooden furniture to entertain guests and enjoy the pitch perfect setting. They also have a combination tennis and basketball court with a lagoon style pool nearby to relax around. Finally, this property also features a guest house which the family has nicknamed La Casita. Our guest house is actually two bedrooms. So this is the living room, it's a small little living room. Uh, no refrigerator in here yet, gotta work on that, but still a full size kitchen. And they even have their own little kitchen table. Yeah. Cole and Savannah like to make their guests feel at home during their stay and have made sure there are a few different options when it comes to selecting a bed for the night. All right, now that we know where the LeBrant family spends majority of their time, let's take a quick look at the home they purchased for Savannah's mom. It's our second house, my mom lives here. She's super cute and super thankful. She's like so excited. She loves this house so much, especially with like everything that's going on right now. She was in a really small apartment. Savannah's mom is the only family that the LeBrant have close by to them, and they spend a lot of time here so that grandma can spoil her grandkids. Hello! Hello! Hello. Savannah's mom revealing the vlog! <laughs> Woo! Hey, Hi, Pussy! This is Gigi as we call her. Let's begin by taking a look at the outside patio with its comfy outdoor sofa and white picket fence. Then moving inside, the living room and kitchen are connected together and make for some very clean sight lines. Upstairs, the bathroom is pretty big and features a painting that Cole likes to pass off as his own. There's even a room dedicated to the grandkids that features a giant wall-sized chalkboard for arts and crafts and kids-sized dollhouse to boot for epic playtime. The master bedroom features a king-size bed with tasteful furnishings and a decked out ensuite bathroom with walk-in shower and a large tub for relaxing in. More importantly, it's got a ton of space for playing around with the people who matter most. <laughs> Oh, Bumsy Bear! I'm doing my toy on the bed! One, oh no! Two, three! Ah! All right, guys, that's gonna bring our LeBrant family house tour to a close. What did you guys think of their two places? There's no doubt that their primary house is the nicest of the two, but how cute was that home they bought for Savannah's mom? I'd be perfectly happy living at either home or maybe just spending a night or two at one of them. So if you're listening guys, Michael and I are always up for a collab video. Let's do your place first and then when Michael and I finally get a new place in Toronto, you guys can come visit. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and we can chat about what you guys want to see next on this channel and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye!